letters and like, oh, by the way, Teresa, okay. it's, it's all fake. We're going to get this note about new beginnings, but it's fake. It's just wow. so she can make up. That's so studio. terrible. That's so to, terrible. Like, make allies. She really hates you. She's worse than before. All this stuff. So I was just like, oh, okay, okay, I got it. You know, I'm like, we'll see wow. what she has to say. You know? But so there were things like I yeah. did. You know? So I, I was very confused as to who to trust, what to trust. Um, but, you know, when Teresa and I started getting along on the show, I was like, all right, well, I'd rather have her fake it and be nice with me and have a nice, pleasant filming yeah. than have her fighting with me on camera. Yeah. She fights with me, I give it back. But if she's being nice, I'll be nice, you know? So. Absolutely. Absolutely. Hey, you guys, my phone's going dead. Are you kidding? I to, I, I'm, I'm losing energy. Um, if, so if I have to back out, you guys finish it. Okay, we'll wrap up <laughs> soon. Anyway, try Go not ahead. to die, Kim, or plug no, it I'm in. No, I'm going to try not to die. I just saw it said low battery. I don't know why. Go ahead. Well, I was going to ask if, like, do you think that Melissa is doing this, like, now on the show? Like, you know, she, apparently she's friends with Margaret and Jackie. I mean, Jackie's demoted. Like, I don't know if you watch the show now, but, like, do you think she is still? Because it sounds like she's a producer. Oh, wait, what now? Is well, because like, it sounds producer? like with well, what she was doing to you. I mean, that's like what a producer does, like making up all and telling you, you know, Teresa's doing this and that. I mean, do you think she's doing the same type of like manipulation to like Margaret and Dolores and all these other people that are apparently her I'm friends? I'm sure she got in there. I think she's very careful who she does it to. So if she thinks Dolores will go back and tell Teresa, she's not going to break her act in front of Dolores. Um, did she used to talk about her in front of Dolores? She did. Um, I don't know about now. I don't know now because we haven't discussed it, but, um, I don't know. I'm sure she's behind the scenes saying they, I'm sure they have their conversations behind the scenes and they have their conversations behind the scenes and they're bringing up all the stuff and doing everything. And Melissa's staying out of it. Like mm -hmm. she did to Kathy. I'm sure that's going on, but I don't know. And I can't really answer to that. Cause I don't know. Right. I mean, is wow. she capable of it? Yeah, definitely capable. Are you kidding me? Definitely. Do you watch the show now, Jacqueline? And Kim and I, I do. This season, I'm I'm watching it this season. I didn't see the last. Is there three episodes or four right now? Four now. Yeah, I saw three. Um, up until then, I didn't watch the show. I watched the reunions, and then I would watch like a key episode. If someone's like, "Oh, you got to watch this episode," she pulls yeah. her hair or whatever. Then I I, I watch that. But I I haven't seen it since I left. But this season, I'm watching every episode, and I've seen the first three. Other than Melissa, do you think it's time for anyone else to go? I haven't followed their storylines enough to know what's happening on there. What about the new girls? I, what do you think of them, the two new young ones? Um, I think um, Danielle, actually, she's going to be good. I think she's going to make good TV. Mm -hmm. I think mm -hmm. funny. And I could tell she's a character, so like, yes. I think she'll be good. Um, the other one's a little quiet yet. Her storyline hasn't opened up yet. Like right. I don't know enough about comments, um, but I think Danielle will be great. Um, I think that Jen would be good too, um, but she's what a friend of. Friend yeah. of, yeah. I don't like Jen. <laughs> I don't she like her. Fres Fresler? What's her name? Fresler? Fessler, Jen, yeah. uh, Jen Fessler. I don't like her. She talked shit about that. Ziggy. She talked shit about Ziggy and said oh. she hated her. Wait, and then sent Siggy a text. As soon, yeah, and that, that's a, and sent Siggy a text the day after saying, I didn't really say it. It was a bad edit. And Ziggy gave me the text and I was allowed to put it out. And me and David put the text out. Ah! <laughs> that's hilarious. Isn't that? I got her the uh, first, the first day out. Yeah. But she, she's not a housewife. She's a friend of, but I do think friend that of. Danielle will be a good. Addition. I or, do too. Uh, we yeah, both I, like her. We both like her. Danielle will be a good addition to the show. I think. Yeah, she's me a too. Good character. Yep. Kind of technically my step niece. Yes, that's exactly yes. right. There's kind <laughs> of a relation. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of kind of, yeah. Go on. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. No, no, no go ahead. No, she's done. I was going to say, well, you know, speaking of your family and everything, I know you spoke to Caroline and you said she was still having a tough time, like you know, with everything that's rumored to have happened at Girls Trip, like. Do you know anything new? Like, have you heard from her? Like, no, we didn't really talk about it. She was too upset and trying to process everything and just, you know, very traumatized by it all. So I didn't push it and we didn't talk about it. 
do you know Brandy? Like, and have you ever met her through the I Housewives? I've never met Brandy. Um, I was supposed to do her podcast, but then I kind of canceled that when all that happened yeah. because I just felt funny. That's tough. That's tough, that. Jack. That's I've tough. I've never met her. Um, you know. You you but, you canceled the podcast because of all this. Well, I I think it wouldn't it would be in bad taste to yeah. do it. I do too. <laughs> You know, and with everything uncomfortable, on, it would be uh, uncomfortable, Jacqueline. Be very uncomfortable. I, I'm just waiting to see. You know, I just, I just know that my sister in law. It was very traumatic for her, and she's upset. So, you know, um, I don't even know the whole story. So I'm just gonna have to wait for it to come out, like everyone else, because I'm not gonna push it. You know, probably that much when she, you know, she's if she wanted to talk about. It, listen, yeah. Wow. But, are you shocked to hear all this? Like just knowing yeah. some of it? Yeah, that's pretty fucked up. <laughs> it is. I don't know. Me and David, so the minute we heard, we're like, we'd fucking sue. We'd sue. We'd be, I'd be on the phone. As soon as it happened, I'd be on the in the bathroom on the phone with my lawyer. He's been legit to everybody and probably made everybody. a lot of money. So that's right. I don't right. know what she's going to do, but um, yeah. I mean. We would. I would sue, but yeah. you don't. I, I, I would say. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So would I, 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 I think, yeah, I, I want to hear the whole, exactly what right. happened. Right. You know, right. The whole story and how bad it is, you know? Yeah. Well, maybe Caroline is not talking because she is suing. That could be. Could be. Could be. Could be. Um, could be. I'm, I'm trying to picture if I was at the, girls trip and she was like trying to do all that to me i would just be like get the fuck off of me yeah like, for me yeah like, yeah i, don't I would too like, i would too like, what, are you doing? what the like, fuck are you doing I exactly know how intense it was I don't yeah know what and remember I don't know, like, caroline's really teeny weeny now she was always there yeah. but she's and brandy's a tall girl you yeah. know she just she got she shook her up she clearly yeah. shook her up. You know what I mean? She probably was like, what the H is going on? Caroline is different than Jacqueline. I mean, Jacqueline and I in that moment, I'm not saying I w- still wouldn't sue, but I think we would just I mean, handle it fight. differently. <laughs> yeah, you're a fighter. So am I. I'd be like, what the fuck? Are you crazy? You yeah. know what I mean? So no, but uh, Caroline's not like that. And I think she really got flustered and freaked out. You know what I mean? And listen, that's that could happen with anyone. And and what Brandy did, if she did put her hands on her or her tongue, you don't do that. That's not, that's unacceptable yeah. in any situation. Especially it's unacceptable. Nowadays, especially oh nowadays, yeah. You don't play now. Like don't touch anybody without no. them, like nope. telling you. You gotta be careful yeah. what you say. Never mind touching. I yeah. just wonder if Caroline is suing or having a discussion, are we even ever going to see girls trip for, I mean, I imagine this is there's editing and there's something is going on because I mean, the rumors, they were in a bathroom and the door was locked and Alex McCord was in there and Carol yeah. let me out. And they were yeah. mic'd at the time. So it's yeah. I mean, on the mic. Why on was audio. Alex McCord in the bathroom? <laughs> Yeah, she, I want to know that too. Why was she in there? She's like, a witness. Why aren't you getting yeah, her on the podcast? That's right. Her. And wait, and she unlocked the door because she saw Caroline. Yeah. yeah, she unlocked the door. So, but listen, it's going to be, this is going to be. Is that crazy. hearsay or is that a fact? I mean, do we really know? I think, I think she said it. I think Alex said that she unlocked the door. Yeah, I think she said it. Yeah. What about, you know, do you think, you know, because I know this was, you had a seven-year friendship with Teresa. I know the therapy and Louie and it all went, but like, do you think Teresa is now on an apology tour? Not even in a bad way, just to like make amends. And do you think Kim D is going to be next? Do you think she wants <laughs> to go and make amends with Danielle Staub, Kathy and, 